I think you could do it. So, Falco versus Puff. I'd give this matchup to Puff just because Falco just kind of dies to Puff easily. Yeah, she's super good at edge guarding, so uh, she needs to get him off stage. Yeah, but Puff's ability to go in on a camping Falco is significantly tougher. But the thing is, Puff never has to commit to an approach, unlike Falco. So it's going to be a really patient game for Handy. Yeah, and with, with uh, such flexible vertical movement, it seems like it's not super easy to hit her with lasers from across the stage. Maybe up close. Yeah. <laughs> Drink Food's going to just try to make it so that none of her aerials can come out when he's approaching with lasers. He's kind of just shooting them randomly. I wish he would mix it up a little, but it's working right now. And they're going to take it off the top corner. Yeah, Drinking Food looking really clean right now. Yeah, he really didn't get touched that whole first stock at 7%. Yeah, still looking good. Jeez, he's just uh, locking down this puff, not allowing her to approach at all. If I was um, handy, I'd stick to the ledge more whenever Falco's shooting lasers. Cause as Puff, you, I don't want to say you can't be on platforms, but it's harder to come down on Falco because he has up tilt back air. All right, up tilt really good at stuffing approaches. Falco's aerials are just really strong. There we Ooh, go. That's going to be it. Yeah, that was a nice gimp. He needs another one of those. Yeah, or a rest. We'll even up the game. Yeah, there's -Smash. always that wild card. Yeah. S-Mash might kill at this percent with good DI. Ooh. I like the down throw tech chase. Kind of locked him into the corner. He shot a laser to cover center stage and ran the other way. Doesn't get the shine follow up. Yeah, this time he just opted to run for center stage, opted to get a tech read. And it's really safe too because Jigglypuff can't do anything if you mess that up. <laughs> Ooh, trades. Uh, you're up on yeah. Yeah. What? Hmm? Okay, so solo Codolo commentary. Let's go. I got you. Yeah, yeah, I got it. So. Dream Food has a really good lead. He can really just start going in now, but I mean, better to play to your lead than throw it away, right? I'm just going to build all the percent he can so he can kill him with one solid hit. Second to last stock or last stock. Good back air. Can he get to the edge? He just decides to stay there. I feel like as Puff, he should try going out there. Ooh, we're hitting on F smash. And that back air is going to do it. Yeah, 140. You're a Falco. Drinking Boo should have just jumped down and dare. That would have been the hypest. Down throw. Ooh, this time gets punished for it. Um, using lasers to lock down. That recovery is not... He's not protecting himself well at all there. I'd, I'd like to see Drinking Food take advantage of that. He also had the stock lead, so he very well could have went for the dare there. Um, but I mean, again, playing it safe, Drinking Food up 1-0. Probably going to go Dreamland. 3 of 5, yeah. Now, this is really where the matchup gets fun. Because now any horizontal kill really won't kill on Jigglypuff. But Falco's will die to back air still and easy edge guards. Um, the vertical kill off down tilt, important to mention, as we saw right there, won't kill as early. That's important because it shield pokes and Jigglypuff's defensive. Unless they're angling their shield down. Ooh! Gets the meteor, but making it back, impressive, but jab down there. Down there. Wow. Uh, Handy really has to make something happen here. It says Puff, you don't want to be down against a space animal. Uh, keeps him up. Here 
doing some back airs. That's going to do it. Ooh, reverses. Never mind. It's not what you want to see. Dragon Food just going to build percent with lasers, even if they scale. It's still worth it. Any percent is good percent. Runs into fair, and... Oh, misfaces the fair, but it's okay. He covered stage, grabs ledge, and gets punished. You gotta be faster on those. Uh, drinking food up two stocks. Um, any solid back air is gonna kill. Like, yeah. There we go. Uh, even stocks. Not even, I'm sorry. Drinking food up one out. Um, I wanna be surprised... Oh, you can't be whipping that. Doesn't really get too punished. Um, Candy missed an opportunity to jab reset rest. Drinking food did not react immediately on the tech. But, I mean, it's cool. Oh, that invincible drill. Oh, wow, he's just tech chasing with drills. And that's where you, you really need to go out and fare there. There's no reason if, like, he telegraphed that he was side being on the stage. Yeah, that'll take it. Uh, not up air rest. I'm kind of surprised. Up throw rest, I mean. Because, oh, it's Falco, so you got to build up more percent. That that makes sense to just throw him off stage. Sorry about that. Um, tech chase. Dragon Food has been really nailing his tech chases lately. And he's also been doing a good job in neutral, finding his openings. And he needs to make note. Because whenever he gets hit with the laser at, like, mid-range, mid-distance, the Falco comes in with a drill, and he misspaces his recovery there and gets an F smash for it. Uh, Dream Food still up a stock. Ooh, I like that up smash. Yeah. That time, he he went in, but he Dream Food actually did a really good job there, acting like he was going to... Um, up B and go straight to ledge, but instead he faded further back so he could get the sweet spot side B. So that was actually just really good play by Drinking Food, but Handy gets the gimp on him, and this game is very doable now. He just needs one solid rest. Um, you're not going to get Drinking Food with shield grabs. He's a really seasoned player, to say the least. He knows to space his aerials, and right as I say that, he gets shield grabbed. So... It's all just a mix-up, and he did not have any jumps. That's a shame. But, I mean, we'll take it. Um, so, he's probably going to run it back. There's no reason to go to any other stage, really. Unless you want FD, but then you just kind of get lasered down. But yeah, this is, this is your best stage. That's pop. Uh, up air, rest. There you go. That's how you do it. Drinking food with the DI, though. He's not going to get punished. Never mind. Drinking food is just that good. <laughs> Maybe he should have went to a smaller stage, so rest would have killed. Nah, just kidding. This is Jigglypuff. That... Yeah. <laughs> I like how he kind of sat above platform, kind of baiting out, like, when am I going to land on it? And then he never did, and it worked out in his favor. Um, forward throw to grab ledge, to forward throw back air. That's a nice edge guard by Handy. And Dream Food kills himself. I need to update the score. Dream Food up 2 -0. So, yeah, this may be wraps. It may be the slowest wraps ever. Never mind, Dream Food actually closed that stock out fairly well. Andy needed to air dodge there, but he didn't want to be in the end lag because Drinking Food was going towards stage, so he kind of just ate a drill. Drinking Food saw that coming. Now Drinking Food just all over him right now. And <laughs> you saw Jigglypuff pivot. I'm pretty sure those are supposed to be dash dances. Oh. Uh -huh. Interesting to note, both of them are green because, um, they think of the trees, they're on dreamland, you know. Ha, 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 ha. They're definitely not trying to rep Hungrybox or PPMD. Ooh, that back air will not take it. I think this is the one of the many times dreamland has helped Jigglypuff. Ooh, 
he jabbed the or he di'd the jab so that he wouldn't get the drill. But drinking food was ready. Kills him off the top. Ooh, up throw, up air. Ah, uh, you gotta go for the tech read first. Yeah, drinking food knowing he really can't get a punish at that low percent the drill, so he just down smashes him. And, uh, here we go. Throws out a fair, throws out a fair. Throws out a fair, throws out an air. That should have been fair. Ooh, meteors! Oh, this game has evened up significantly. Training food with the lead. I'd say Handy just, he didn't position himself well. He put himself in the spot where Training Food wants to shoot a laser to follow up, and back here's gonna take it. Yeah. I think I'm doing okay, I don't know. I'm kinda, as solo commentary, I get the reason to just play by play, so it's like, Ooh. Dream food with a big combo. Ooh, my. Calm down. Oh my goodness! That down smash into the taunt, into drill. Dream food, you are a monster. Oh my god. Handy just got called out on every tech, miss tech, get up attack into that sick conversion. And then he, he did it really recover optimally. He kind of just put himself out there, and Dreamy Food will take that any day. And um, we now have the problem of, I don't know anyone else coming up. Um, this is awkward. Uh, the puff didn't move, so I'm going to assume this is some sort of a this might be, that was winner's finals, so this might be loser's finals. Um, who's the... Okay. Who's the uh, other player? Handy stayed in, right? This is loser's finals. Okay, yeah, yeah. Handy stayed in. It should be no one's hero. Setx? S-E-T-X, -S no one's hero. Yeah. <laughs> S-E-T-X. Yeah, nobody's here. That's it. Ooh, Falcon beat Puff. 